Good evening. Welcome to T.J. Trisham's State of the Channel Address. I'm D.J. Trisham. Yes, folks, hold on. All right. The <clears throat> the giant candy bar that I displayed earlier has been dug into. A little chunk about maybe gay big. Barely candy bar size, but I enjoyed it. Much debate and much decision went into digging into this candy bar. But a pe one or two people tell me, go for it. So, I did. And I like it. Was a bit a little harder to bite into because it was an inch thick. But I liked it. But, there's other news. There is. Last night's uh, DJ gig went well. Um, the movie one night went well until, um, towards the end, I, I'm not cl real clear on what exactly happened, but apparently someone tried to climb a fence in the back of the store and someone called the police. That, um, usually I play, like, um, the music after the movie, that, you know, and I uh, play like a patriotic um, song at the end of the night or some cool special song. I wasn't sure what song I was going to play. I was thinking that's what friends are for. Because seven months ago, I did not know if we were ever going to ever have a movie night again. But the town pulled together and it got done. Um, however, at the end of the night, um, uh, someone tried to climb a fence. I'm not sure if it was someone at movie night or someone on the other side of the bridge. But someone called the police because someone's climbing the fence and it's Police arrived, they started asking questions of Eric and, you know, stuff, and it pretty much, you know, squashed the happy spirit that was. And, uh, not to get off subject, but I will say this. If you're having a problem with your neighbor, before calling the police, just kindly go over to the neighbor and what, do what I call conflict resolution. Conflict resolution is between you and the other person having a discussion um, be, and, and keep it from getting escalated to the point where the police are involved. And, you know, the, you know, it's easy enough to call the police and go, hey man, someone's, uh, you know, climbing my fence. But it's mainly a thing to say, or go over to the person that's, you know, climbing the fence and say, hey, that's wrong. Don't do that. This is my property, my house. Get off there. But, it, you know, instead of manning up and, you know, doing what you should do, and, I mean, I could see if, he, you know, the person didn't listen and yeah, I had to call the police, but just to right away pick up the phone without going out there with a you know manliness or womanliness or whatever to say, hey, this is my property. Stop that, you know. And if they didn't obey, if they you know, then you call the police. But it, before you call the police, you should um. 
have the, um, how shall I say, guts to go over there and practice conflict resolution before you call the police. If the conflict can't be re resolved between you and the other party, then you say, look, I've done all I can, now I'm going to take it a step further. Alright? Because, you know, if your friend, neighbor, whatever person nearby is having a gathering and things get out of control with the kids or whatever, and not everybody can watch the kids. I understand that, but you, you can just step up and go, hey, you know, call it. If they don't, you know, then you go to... But unfortunately, that's people's first reaction to call the police. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, but this is not about conflict resolution or the police or whatever. But this is about, first of all, I want to say, I want to, and I should have done this from the top, but I got off of my thing. First of all, um... I should say, um, I noticed when I logged on, I had 197 subscribers. Wow. Thank you, everybody. Thank you very much. Um, I have an idea in mind. But I'm not going to say it because it's going to be something good. I hope you all embrace it because um, um, I think you all enjoy I hope you all enjoy it. Oh, and before I go on, last uh, regarding last night, I did get a beautiful t-shirt. Do, 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 woo! Yeah. This is from 2011, and the other end is, don't know if you can see that, but um, I think a local artist um, made this drawing that's on the back of my shirt, not sure if you saw it, and made it for the beach house. I, I think that's just so special. And... Um, you know, at the start of the night, um, I know I'm getting off, but anyway, you get off subject here. But anyway, uh, Derek, um, you probably saw him in early videos. I hope to show him again with his nice haircut. Guy with a longish, wavy hair. Anyway, he's throwing out t-shirts. He goes, trash, trash. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> Like, and I caught one, it was a free X large, I take a, uh, just an X large, so, uh, yeah, so we, we did swap out, and it worked, I love it, and, um, <clears throat> okay, so back to the, back, I, I also got a hat, which is on the handlebars of my bike, and, uh, yeah, I, I remember the pack and my backpack um, every day be, so people don't steal it. Um, my last hat, I think, I went somewhere, someone was walking by, saw the hat and snagged it, and uh, wasn't alert. Either that or the wind took it, but I think someone snagged my last hat. Anyway, I like the, uh, the one I ha um, now have. Anyway... Um, getting back to the subject of music, and, um, last night the gig went well, um, before the <laughs> music, uh, you know, before the movie started, you know, um, Derek's father, Steve and I, we, uh, figured out what kind of chords... Well, he had the chord, but he told me it was a um, RCA plug with a, oh my God, oh, I forget, but uh, um, eighth inch something, but 
once I, I'll, I'll go to, um, you know, I'll go to, like, Ocean County Music and say it in eighth inch, whatever. Um, either that or I'll consult the owner's manual. Anyway, the movie was very cool. You know, I'm not big into surf movies, but seeing a surf movie on the big screen, you're sitting there and you see, you know, the great photography, the cinematography they do, and the photography, and it's like, you feel like you're right there, you know? That's what's cool about those movies, is like, oh my god, you're, you're right there, you know? Um, so yeah, I enjoyed the movie too, um, let's see what else. Um, I'm sure you guys have noticed that, um, that I haven't been shooting many, um, music updates lately, but next week, I hope that my luck will change. Um, I ordered something, on, two things online. I hope to get them Tuesday or Wednesday. That's my guess. And, um, Tuesday, I hope to go do a little more digging and to have my, um, out my CD of the week and song of the week. This week it didn't happen between work and things I had to do and stuff like that. It just didn't happen this week. Um, I did, however, send out a, um, a package of VCLT last week and a, a few packages of VCLT was it yesterday? It was yesterday, yes. Um, cause yesterday was Saturday, thinking the post office closing, uh, uh, post office opened at 8.30, but they opened at 9. So my game plan was go to the post office, mail out the packages, have time to go to the bakery, have some coffee, relax before I had to go, eh, to work. And that wasn't happening. I had to do it right in reverse. Oh, uh, but that's okay. That's okay. You know, I, I got done what I had to do. And how many packages did I mail out yesterday? Five, six. Sydney got hers. Sydney, I'm glad you got your uh, yours. And uh, I know you make mixes too, so... Uh, if you're inspired to send me one or two, I I welcome it. I, I do, because you have great taste in music. You do. And, uh, folks, if you don't believe me, Sydney's young, and uh, she has great taste in music, especially when it comes to the Beatles. Hey, anybody loves the Beatles? They're in my book, you know what I'm saying? And, um... Check out her channel, and, um, also check out Adam's channel, because, uh, yeah, I sent, I plan to send him something, too. Um, oh, my gosh, there's just so much things rolling through my mind. This is second take, by the way. The first take, I had it all planned out, but. I've since had three glasses of wine, a few pieces of chocolate, and I've been up since 8.30. Yeah. Anyway, I'm getting some stuff in the mail this week, I hope. I plan to do a little digging and this week, perhaps Tuesday, being Tuesday is my day off. Yeah. Um, uh, let's see. Oh, man. Almost time for haircut time. Cut, haircut time again. What are you mean, haircut time? What are you talking about? My hand getting flipping long, you know? What's wrong with my hair? Bloody hair. All right, that was my uh, 
Maya Rockstar and Maya Ozzy Osbourne interpretation. Interpretation. Boy, boy, you you think you're real funny, Mullins? You ain't real funny. You call a suck a lot. You suck. You suck. Keep the your keep the your mixes. Don't try to be a flipping comedian, or right? And uh, <laughs> what was that? I mean, I, I could have sworn Ozzy Osbourne was here. Oh man, maybe I better call Dan. Um, where, where's the phone? Oh man, I can't find the phone, maybe. Hello? Hello? Who's this? It's Fresh. Oh, you're trying to call 911 on me, are you? No, who is this? You know, it's a good one, right? You didn't try to rock me out or, or make it swim with the blooming fishes in that lagoon, right? Don't try to just uh, keep away from imitating British officers, you know. Right, all right. Okay, folks. Guess I've been told. Anyway, I hope everybody's doing well. Um, another uh, vinyl update coming very soon. In the next few days, I hope. Hope to do some digging soon. More digging. And uh, perhaps even a CD review or two. Anyway, <laughs> I'm being goofy, I know. Hey, it's Monday, what can I... No, it's Sunday. Pshoo! 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 Stop hitting me! Come on, come on! No, 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 focus, peace, peace, yes. Anyway, I hope everybody has a great week. Uh, uh, peace, love, and keep the good tune spinning, folks. Hope you enjoy this state of the channel review. And Wes, I wasn't copying you. I was just inspired by you, all right? Peace, everybody, peace. Where's the stinking cursor? There it is. There we are.